What is going on everybody? Welcome back to Finance with Parks. In today's video, I want to talk about why I started my career here on YouTube. The first reason is that I just truly enjoy talking about money and personal finance. I was a finance major in college, I spend way too much time tracking my spending on Mint, and I work as a financial analyst in corporate America. 90% of my life already revolves around finance. But after graduating college, I continue to see such a growing gap in knowledge about money. The fact that you can graduate college as a non-business major and not take a single course about basic money management truly infuriates me. And so the motivation for the first video I created actually stemmed from Melissa and I deciding to purchase our first house. We ended up meeting with our seller's agent and she provided kind of a breakdown list of our monthly payment, which I've referenced in the past. And that's the first time I started thinking, wow, people our age, this could be something they're really interested in. From there, it has just grown to discussing other major life events beyond home and car buying, business fundamentals, and even how to set up your 401k. I want to be able to highlight our experiences and to share them with other people so that you can either learn from them or avoid mistakes we've made. As far as goals for this channel go, if someone commented down below that they increased their 401k contribution percentage to get their full company match, whew, don't get me started. I mean, that, that's really what I want to accomplish on this channel is that if there's any way I can help people further their financial knowledge, I will have accomplished what I wanted to on YouTube. I also want to keep this channel relatable. As much as I love hearing Mark Cuban talk about how he became a billionaire, that's not always applicable to everyone's life. That is why I try to be transparent about the decision making I make in my own personal life hoping that maybe it's a little bit more relatable for you watching at home. I just feel like viewers will learn and understand better if the scenarios are relevant to them. We aim to have videos up every Sunday and Tuesday, but I'm still balancing a 40 hour a week full-time job. So between filming and editing, it has already become pretty difficult to balance. I have such a newfound respect for people who make videos full-time because one, talking to a camera is a lot harder than it looks, and two, editing is just a pain in the behind. I would honestly love to do this full time, but there's such a long way to go to make this a reality. That is why I really appreciate all of you watching the videos, liking each one, and also subscribing to the channel. If you do enjoy the free content, it is such an easy thing to do that substantially helps out share these videos with a wider audience. And I obviously have to commend all of you for even watching this video because I'm not naive enough to know that there are a ton of probably more exciting content on YouTube to watch other than personal finance videos. With that, I hope this helped give you a new perspective on the channel and the things you can expect going forward. I'm so grateful for all of you for taking the time to watch these videos and am genuinely appreciative for all the support thus far. Thanks again for following along and remember, finance is fun. See ya.